So um, basically on the platform here, um, we've got the list of filters on the left hand side here. Um, so the, the particle tracer or the stream tracer um, is under this section here, particle traces. And it's, it's kind of a two step process this. Um, we've got all of our main definitions here, but to actually um, position this, we need to go onto seeds. And there's an option to pick. And what you can actually do is you pick the face in which you want to um, in which you want to seed from. So I've actually picked the inlet here, which is pretty sensible. Um, so what I've actually done now is I've picked the face at the inlet of that cut plane. Um, a bit different. Um, let me just hide that cut plane one second. Right. Um, and there's a few things that we can do. Um, to control how many streamlines we have and kind of its distribution. Um, so we can control its spacing, um, which is the distribution here. Um, so for example, if I wanted to um, uh, make it less dense, I could change that to two and there would be more of a space in between each seed. Uh, if I wanted to increase the number of um, seed points, I could say change that to five, five, and that would actually Give me a five by five box. And the other thing we get to do is change the radius of those um, those streamlines. So we can say if we wanted to make them twice as big, if we just change that to one, then we get twice as big streamlines. Um, and obviously you can do this by selecting any face um, that's visible. Um, sometimes, you know, just hiding some faces and making others visible will give you the results that you want. So uh, that's how you visualize it on the platform.